five things that may be sold out before this year ends, before the holidays even get here. So oh. if, if you want them now, you better go out and get them. Because, What's going to be sold out? Uh, number five, spices. Because people are going to be cooking more at home, so they're going to be going buying all the spices. Well, that okay. I cook a lot. Everyone's been cooking since the beginning of the pandemic. It takes a long time to get through one little tiny bottle of basil. So you don't need more than one. It's going to last you a year. So spices, no, that's ridiculous. But fall and the winter are big for spices. And this year it's going to be even bigger. So they're saying, go buy some spices. If you don't have any spices, go get it now. Number four, yarn and craft supplies. Oh, well, I can see them running out of that because, you know, kids are home. They need stuff to do. Because people aren't going to be going out really and shopping a lot mm-hmm. this year. So they might be making things at home. So your grandma's going to actually make you a sweater. So you can, Grandma, no, your hipster daughter is going to make you a sweater. There's a whole trend of yarn stuff, yarn knitting, <laughs> <laughs> knitting with yarn. Right. Um, to the point where last summer... They knit sweaters for all the trees on this one block. They knit a sweater for a bench. They, I mean, like they're knitting. It's not. It's not just sweaters. They're knitting things like crazy. Knitting is a huge thing in the, I guess, the younger millennial hipster world. Mm-hmm. They're really into knitting. Like you'd be on a subway and there's a girl next to you. She's 22 and she's sitting there knitting. Oh, really? Oh, yeah huge well you can learn it on on youtube now see the problem was you had to wait for your grandma to show you how to do it but now you can learn online how to <laughs> no do there it. were knitting classes they would all meet and they would have these knitting circles <laughs> that's where they would do it but you're right now you can just do it on youtube easy mm-hmm. number three nintendo switch oh it, yeah that'll be gone it was hot before the pandemic but now since everybody's home, they're playing those a little bit more. So it's not going to be around during Christmas. So if you want one, get one now. And wait, it's not just like your teenage son who has those. My boyfriend and his friends all have Nintendo Switch. They have whatever. They have PlayStation. They have whatever. Xbox. Like, they're really into it. They're really into it. Like that, uh, what is it? Red Redemption? Red something Redemption? Red Dead Redemption. Red Dead Redemption. They're obsessed with it. So the Switch, is it's hot. It was hot before. It's going to be hotter now. Number yeah. two, puzzles and board games. Really? Yeah, people are getting back to that again. Puzzles now, believe it or not, is the hottest thing. In the South, that's what all the old people are doing now. My parents, nonstop, that's all they do are puzzles. But once you're done with the puzzle what do you do with it they take it apart and put it back in the box but see the problem with my parents is they buy puzzles from garage sales oh so this piece is missing <laughs> so if you got ten thousand pieces there's like three missing number okay. one thing that you need to buy right now before it's gone for the holidays fitness equipment which is really scarce it's already anyway. gone yeah no it's been gone i mean i have a friend that she's been on a wait list for not just an an indoor exercise bicycle, an actual bicycle. Like she wants a bike in the city so she can get around. Like she's like, "How'd you get a bike?" I'm like, "This I've had this for years." They're like, "Oh my god, you have a bicycle?" I was like, "Yeah, New Yorkers have bicycles. How do you not have one?" But now you can't get a bicycle. Forget about an indoor bike and forget about any of the um systems, like you know, any of the really expensive ones. They're they're gone. So those are already gone. It's not even like they'll be gone for the holidays. I thought, you know, I have my indoor exercise bike that you put together when we were in Long Island. Mm -hmm. You did that for me. Um, I thought, you know, this is fun. I'm enjoying it. Let me also get a treadmill. That way I can run and bike. Couldn't couldn't find a treadmill. They're all gone. Yeah. Gone. That's what they're saying now. It's the run on treadmill. The run on treadmills right now. No, they were gone in April. Okay. I tried to get one in like April or May. It's been these. Have, these have been gone. Yeah, kettlebells. Another thing. Gone. Gone. So you can't get kettlebells. You can't get weights. So if you want these things <laughs> now, you better go like this weekend. And uh, just to let you know, women love it when you buy them treadmills for Christmas. Oh yeah, do, does, that, it doesn't call them fat at all. No, that's <laughs> awesome. They love it when you you put it under the tree. Trust me, I've done this before. <laughs> <laughs> I bought a treadmill for Christmas. They love it. Yeah, yeah, it's very um, uh, f- flattering.